so exciting. We're getting ready to satirize all things Pittsburgh, and it's totally off the record. So the Biome is welcoming back a ton of zany characters from really all over the city to poke fun at themselves and their colleagues with a night of mayhem, music, and off-the-wall laughs. And you know what? It's all for a great cause. And word on the street is you'll see me and David on stage as well. So oh joining us now is Chris Latta, the director of Off the Record. We're so glad you could come in and talk to us about this. Thank you so much for having me. It is an amazing honor to be again. This is our 23rd year of yeah. doing Off the Record, and this is my second year directing live. I did two years virtual, so it's wonderful to be back. Like, it's stuff that you wouldn't necessarily think people would say on the record, and maybe why people laugh a little harder. Well, I would yeah. especially lean into the scene that you're both in. Uh -huh. Right. Um, <laughs> it is it is very outrageous. I think fans of the show w will be shocked and delighted to see what happened I, and you can't say anything more than that because yeah, that's really all it is. is like you can't say it is just it's wild can it i is say a wild i was not going to be part of this yeah because because my alarm clock rings at two in the morning and you guys have practices and i just wasn't able to to make it happen so i was kind of excited that someone was going to play me yes and, that and I we could, lost the person at the last minute which happens it happens right. Right, it's theater. And then so the show the must go on. So then I'm getting bombarded with text messages from this one and then from you. And then you sent your cat, Charlie, yeah. a with, picture. with a special message. And I said, all right, I'm a sucker for a cat. I'll do this. I know. <laughs> That's all and, I, and, and I knew that that would be my ace in the hole. Like, if, you if anyone's going to convince him, <laughs> it's a cat, Charlie. All right, so you're going to teach us. We're not in this this no. part of this, this song and dance, but you're going to teach us just a little bit of this spotted lantern fly yeah. dance. So, of course, spotted lantern flies are in this show and um, I actually request, requested that the song Levitating by Dua Lipa is one of the songs that we that was my ask because I love the song so the sponsor the spotted lantern flies are a group of girls um, that I teach at Kappa and they come out you know all with their wings glamour. Okay, wait. and the um, sort of the refrain of the song it goes like this you stomp me I come back stronger it's what I do proliferating our body parts accumulating yeah 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 so it's just a lot of trying to kill the flies then <laughs> being like it's never gonna die we're amazing Kay. and then a little wing flap okay well, right. yeah, time? yeah there's no way i'm gonna get this but yeah That's, let's do it you got it you got it all right and you, you stomp, stomp me us. oh i come, come back, back stronger. stronger it's what i do proliferating <laughs> our body parts Accumulating. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got it. <laughs> I didn't even attempt to sing. I knew I, I cannot well, do two yeah. things at once. I don't know the words. This, That's okay. No, this is what's really important to mention. Heather and I are not singing or dancing. No. Like yes. Well, so, well, you might no, be doing something, maybe a little, right? Maybe. Me, not me. No, no. But okay. you. Because you, uh, you know my skill level. And <laughs> well, I, th I think the, that's the best thing about the show, is that it's both professionals and people who have never, never done this before. Never done, that's the charm right. of it. So uh, you're going to have the best time. Well, I promise you. I, I want to add this, too. I think we should talk about this, because this is a collaboration of unions, SAG-AFTRA, Newspaper mm -hmm. Guild, and the United Steelworkers, and all doing this really to raise money. Yeah. It's, it's really, it's been sort of a passion project for both unions, and I think that it's really Pittsburgh at its yeah. best. Um, I ran into someone today that's like, I can't, I can't wait. wait. It's next week. It's this week, right? And I said, October 12th, Biome Theater. Yes, it's like this event that people love because everyone comes together. Everyone supports the community. And it, it makes me emotional because the, the, it just keeps going on and on. Yeah. Right. And, and we should say it supports the food bank. Food the bank. Money raised. Yep. Yeah. Which is a cause, you know, we love so much. We love. Yep. Oh. Yeah. Chris, thank you so much. Thank you. I can't wait. I cannot wait. And please. come see them. They're going to be hilarious. Yeah. Come see us, the rest of the gang, and off the record coming up this Thursday, October 12th at the Bime. You do not want to miss it. All right. Tickets are on sale right now. And remember, it does benefit the Greater Pittsburgh Community Food Bank. Oh, yeah. David. Only it's you happening. would be inspired to be to join by a cat. She sent me a, a text <laughs> message with her cat's picture, and I was like, oh, I guess I'll do it. All right. We do want to mention, you know, uh, we taped that last week, and, and Heather's a little under the weather this week, so she's not going to be able to join off the record in person. However, we're figuring out a way that she may be able to join electronically. Ooh. So watch for that. Stay it's tuned. all happening Thursday night. Who knows what's going to happen Thursday night? Well,